Location of Bornholm and Region Hobbitstedden. Bornholm is a Danish island in the Baltic Sea, to the east of the rest of Denmark, south of Sweden, northeast of Germany and north of Poland. Occupying an area of 588. 36 square kilometers, the island had a total population of 39,610 on October 1, 2021. Among Bornholm's chief industrial activities are dairy farming and arts and crafts industries such as glass production and pottery using locally worked clay. Tourism is also important during the summer months. The island is home to many of Denmark's round churches. The island is known as Salskinsen because of its weather and Klippen because of its geology, which consists of granite, except along the southern coast. The heat from the summer is stored in the rock formations, and the weather is quite warm until October. As a result of the climate, a local variety of the common fig, known as Bornholm's diamond, can grow locally on the island. The island's topography consists of dramatic rock formations in the north sloping down towards pine and deciduous forests. Farmland in the middle and sandy beaches in the south. Strategically located in the Baltic Sea, Bornholm has been fought over for centuries. It has usually been ruled by Denmark, but also by Sweden and Lübeck, Germany. The ruin of Hammersus, at the northwestern tip of the island, is the largest medieval fortress in northern Europe, testament to the importance of its location. This island and Erthulmany is what remains in Denmark of Skaneland east of Orisund, having been surrendered to Sweden in 1658 but with Bornholm after a local revolt later regained in 1660. Hammersus ruin in Old Norse the island was known as Bergendammer, and in ancient Danish especially the island's name was Borgand or Borgen. These names were related to Old Norse Borg height and Jarg slash Berg mountain, rock. As it is an island that rises high from the sea. Other names known for the island include Bergendaland, Humo, Holness, Bergendihum, and Borgandum. The Old English translation of Erosius uses the form Bergendaland. Some scholars believe that the Burgundians are named after Bornholm. The Burgundians were Germanic peoples who moved west when the Western Roman Empire collapsed and occupied and named Burgundy in France. Windmill in Gudjem, Bornholm Bornholm formed part of the historical lands of Denmark when the nation united out of a series of petty chiefdoms. It was originally administratively part of the province of Scania and was administered by the Scanian law after this was codified in the 13th century. Control over the island evolved into a long-raging dispute between the Sea of Lund and the Danish crown culminating in several battles. The first fortress on the island was Gamleborg which was replaced by Lilleborg, built by the king in 1150. In 1149, the king accepted the transfer of three of the island's four herder to the archbishop. In 1250, the archbishop constructed his own fortress, Hammersus. A campaign launched from it in 1259 conquered the remaining part of the island including Lilleborg. The island's status remained a matter of dispute for an additional 200 years. Bornholm was pawned to Lübeck for 50 years starting in 1525. Its first militia, Bornholm's Millets, was formed in 1624. An 1877 windmill at Arsdale Swedish forces conquered the island in 1645, but returned the island to Denmark in the following peace settlement. After the war in 1658, Denmark ceded the island to Sweden under the Treaty of Ruskala along with the rest of the Skaneland, Bohuslän, and Trundelag, and it was occupied by Swedish forces. A revolt broke out the same year, culminating in Willem Clausen's shooting of the Swedish commander Johan Prinzenskold on December 8, 1658. Following the revolt, a deputation of islanders presented the island as a gift to King Frederick III on the condition that the island would never be ceded again. This status was confirmed in the Treaty of Copenhagen in 1660. Swedes, notably from Småland and Scania, emigrated to the island during the 19th century, seeking work in better conditions. Most of the migrants did not remain. Rona, Bornholm Bornholm also attracted many famous artists at the beginning of the 20th century, forming a group now known as the Bornholm School of Painters. In addition to Olaf Hust, they include Carl Isaksson, from Sweden, and the Danes Edvard Y., Olaf Rude, Niels Lerjard, and Kreston Everson. Bornholm, as a part of Denmark, was captured by Germany on April 10, 1940, and served as a lookout post and listening station during the war, as it was a part of the Eastern Front. The island's perfect central position in the Baltic Sea meant that it was an important natural fortress between Germany and Sweden, effectively keeping submarines and destroyers away from Nazi-occupied waters. Several concrete coastal installations were built during the war, and several coastal batteries, which had tremendous range. 
However, none of them were ever used, and only a single test shot was fired during the occupation. These remnants of Nazi rule have since fallen into disrepair, and are mostly regarded today as historical curiosities. Many tourists visit the ruins each year, however, providing supplemental income to the tourist industry. On August 22, 1942 a V-1 flying bomb crashed on Bornholm during a test, the warhead was a dummy made of concrete. This was photographed or sketched by the Danish naval officer in charge on Bornholm, Lt. Commander Hasager Christensen. This was one of the first signs British intelligence saw of Germany's aspirations to develop flying bombs and rockets which were to become known as V-1. Bornholm was heavily bombarded by the Soviet Air Force in May 1945, as it was a part of the Eastern Front. The German garrison commander, German Navy Captain Gerhard von Kamps, refused to surrender to the Soviets, as his orders were to surrender to the Western Allies. The Germans sent several telegrams to Copenhagen requesting that at least one British soldier should be transferred to Bornholm, so that the Germans could surrender to the Western Allied forces instead of the Soviets. When von Kamps failed to provide a written capitulation as demanded by the Soviet commanders, Soviet aircraft relentlessly bombed and destroyed more than 800 civilian houses in Rona and Nexu and seriously damaged roughly 3,000 more on 7 May 8, 1945. The population had been forewarned of the bombardments, and the towns were evacuated, but 10 local people were killed. Soldiers were also killed and wounded. Some of them were conscripts from the occupied Baltic states fighting in German ranks against the Soviets. During the Soviet bombing of the two main towns on 7 and 8 of May, Danish radio was not allowed to broadcast the news because it was thought it would spoil the liberation festivities in Denmark. On 9 May Soviet troops landed on the island, and after a short fight, the German garrison surrendered. Soviet forces left the island on April 5, 1946 as part of the post-war division of interests of the Soviet Union and the Western Allies. Denmark was to be Western-aligned, and in return the Baltic states were to be kept in the Soviet sphere of influence. After the evacuation of their forces from Bornholm, the Soviets took the position that the stationing of foreign troops on Bornholm would be considered a declaration of war against the Soviet Union. And that Denmark should keep troops on at all times to protect it from such foreign aggression. This policy remained in force after NATO was formed, with Denmark as a founding member. The Soviets accepted the stationing there of Danish troops, which were part of NATO but viewed as militarily inferior elements of the alliance, but they strongly objected to the presence of other NATO troops on Bornholm, U.S. troops in particular. On March 5, 1953, the day of Stalin's death, Polish pilot Franciszek Jarecki defected from the Eastern Bloc and landed a MiG-15 fighter on the island. He was later granted asylum and rewarded for providing Western intelligence with the then newest Soviet jet fighter. In 2017, Denmark's Defense Intelligence Service decided to build a listening tower near Ostermarie, almost the size of the Statue of Liberty, to intercept radio communications across the Baltic Sea and in parts of Russia. Ferry routes to and from Bornholm Bornholm and Christianso hundreds and five municipalities in green color and 21 municipalities before April 1, 1970 parishes and Church of Denmark numbered unofficial flag of Bornholm. Unofficial flag of Bornholm. Danabrog is clearly visible with a green cross inserted in the white cross. Old coat of arms of Bornholm. Bornholm Regional Municipality is the local authority covering the entire island. It is the result of a merger of the five former municipalities on the island and the former Bornholm County. Bornholm Regional Municipality was also a county in its own right during its first four years from January 1, 2003 until December 31, 2006. From January 1, 2007 all counties were abolished, and Bornholm became part of the capital region of Denmark whose main responsibility is the health service. The municipality still retains its name Bornholm Regional Municipality. The island had 21 municipalities until March 1970, of which six were market towns and 15 parishes. In addition to supervising parish municipalities, which was the responsibility of the counties in all of Denmark, the market town municipalities of Bornholm were supervised by Bornholm County as well and not by the Interior Ministry as was the case in the rest of Denmark. The seat of the municipal council is the island's main town, Rona. The voters decided to merge the county with the municipalities in a referendum May 29, 2001, effected from January 1, 2003. The question on the ballot was, do you want the six municipal entities of Bornholm to be joined to form one municipal entity as of January 1, 2003? 73. 
9% voted in favor. The lowest percentage for the merger was in Nexu Municipality, whose mayor, Annalise Molin, a social democrat, spoke out against the merger. It was required that each municipality had more yes votes than no votes. Otherwise the merger would have to be abandoned altogether. The six municipal entities had up to 122 councillors, reduced to 89 in the municipalities from the 1990s, in the 1970s and the new regional municipality would have 27 councillors from the start. They were reduced to 23 from January 1, 2018. The merger was approved in a law by the Folketing 19 March 2002, transferring the tasks of the abolished county and old municipalities to the new Bornholm Regional Municipality. The first regional mayor in the first three years from 2003 until 2005 was Thomas Thors, a physician and member of the Social Democrats and previously the last mayor of Rona Municipality for five years from 1998 until 2002. He became a mayor again in 2021. Beyond Christiansen, who was the last mayor of Hasla two plus half years from the summer of 2000 until 2002, representing the local borderless and political party, served as mayor for four years from January 1, 2006 until 2009. From January 1, 2007, Bornholm became a part of the capital region of Denmark. From January 1, 2010 until December 31, 2020 the mayor was Winnie Grosbull, a high school teacher and a member of the Social Democrats' political party. The deputy mayor Morton Rees was mayor for a short interlude from 1 January until January 4, 2021. He is from the Red Green Alliance. Thomas Thors, who was elected again in 2017, became mayor again from January 4, 2021. Bornholm's Municipal Council today consists of 23 members, elected every four years. In the first four local elections in the newly created municipality there were 27 members elected to the Municipal Council. The 2002 local election only took place on Bornholm. From the election in 2017 the number of councillors elected was reduced to 23 members, serving their term of office from January 1, 2018 until December 31, 2021. Below are the election results to the new merged municipal council beginning with the first election May 29, 2002. Ferry services connect Rona to Swinucci, Sosnitz, Co., 45 km by road south of Copenhagen, Denmark. The destination to Co. replaced the nighttime route directly to and from Copenhagen from October 1, 2004, and catamaran services to Usta. Simrasam has a ferry connection during the summer. There are also regular catamaran services between Nexu and the Polish ports of Kowabzik, Liba, and Uska. There are direct bus connections Usta Copenhagen, coordinated with the catamaran. There are also flights from Bornholm Airport to Copenhagen and other locations. Because of its remote location Bornholm Regional Municipality has its own traffic company, BAT, and is its own employment region, and also performs other tasks normally carried out by the regions in the rest of Denmark. In some respects the municipality forms a region of its own. Bornholm Regional Municipality was not merged with other municipalities on January 1, 2007 in the nationwide municipal reform of 2007. The larger towns on the island are located on the coast and have harbors. There is however one exception, centrally placed Akirkabu, which was also the name of the municipality from 1970 until 2002, which did, however, include the harbour, Vagern, 5 km to the south. The largest town is Rona, the seat, in the southwest on the westernmost point of the island. The other main towns are Hasla, Sandvig, Alinga, Budjem, Svanica, and Nexu. Monday morning September 22, 2014 it was documented by folk key registrant in the municipality that the number of people living in the municipality that day were 39,922, the lowest number in over 100 years. As of 2018, Statistics Denmark gave the populations as follows, the town of Rona after the merger of the island's administrative entities January 1, 2003 reached a low point of 13,568 inhabitants January 1, 2014. 15,957 people in 1965 lived in the two parishes that would become Rona Municipality from April 1, 1970. In the table, numbers for Rona are for the parish of Rona, Rona Sog, alone. Year unknown, but between 2000 and 2005. It does not include Nudsker Sog, which was also a part of Rona Municipality. Other localities include Arsbal, Arniger, Olsker, Rutsker, Roe, Stensby and Vang. 
In 2010 and 2018 10,297 and 9,111 respectively lived in rural districts, and 88 and 71 had no fixed address. A rural district is defined by Statistics Denmark as a settlement with less than 200 inhabitants. Aerial view of Bornholm year, beginning with 2007, 2018, population numbers are from 1 January. Christianso Parish is not a part of Bornholm Regional Municipality. It is included because Denmark's statistic includes it as parish number 7568. Bornholm has 21 parishes that before April 1, 1970 were parish or market city municipalities themselves. There are 2,158 parishes in the Church of Denmark. Source Statistic Banken. DK slash Befuckning og Vogue slash Fod 207, BIV 107, KM1. Enlargeable. Detailed map of Bornholm on September 22, 2014 population numbers showed fewer than 40,000 inhabitants on the island for the first time in over 100 years. The FOCI register in the municipality could document 39,922 inhabitants in the municipality on that date. Many inhabitants speak the Bornholms dialect, which is officially a dialect of Danish. Bornholms retains three grammatical genders, like Faroese, Icelandic and most dialects of Norwegian, but unlike standard Danish. Its phonology includes archaisms and innovations. This makes the dialect difficult to understand for some Danish speakers. However, Swedish speakers often consider Bornholmian to be easier to understand than standard Danish. The intonation resembles the dialects spoken in nearby Scania, Blekinge and Holland the southernmost provinces of Sweden. Most inhabitants are members of the Lutheran Church of Denmark. Various Christian denominations have become established on the island, most during the 19th century. Landsat satellite photo on the surface of Bornholm older geological formations can be seen better than in the rest of Denmark. Stubbeloken, which is still operating, and Klippeloken granite quarries in Nudsker Parish just east of central Rona. And statistically a part of the town, are among the few remaining quarries of what was once many active quarries on the island. The island's varied geography and seascapes attract visitors to its many beauty spots from the Hammerin Promontory in the northwest to the Almindingen Forest in the center and the Duati beaches in the southeast. Of special interest are the rocky sea cliffs at Johns Koppel and Heligdomsklaperna, the varied topography of Paradisbackern and rift valleys such as Ekodalen and Dondalen. Bornholm's numerous windmills include the Post Mill of Ijby and the well kept Dutch mill at Arsdale. The lighthouse at Duati is Denmark's tallest while Hammer and Lighthouse stands at a height of 85 meters above sea level and Rona Lighthouse rises over the waterfront. Examples of roads that have steep climbs and descents are, Simbelgardsvej and Klemensker, which begins by the village in Klemenskro, and Slamrebjergs just outside Nexu extending northward from the main road from Rona. Along the coast there are several steep roads, which is also the case in some parts of Denmark as a whole, for instance in and around Vejl. Osterler's Church, one of Bornholm's four round churches ruins of Hammersis, a medieval fortress the island hosts examples of 19th and early 20th century architecture. And about 300 wooden houses in Rona and Nexu, donated by Sweden after World War II, when the island was repairing damage caused by the war. The island is home to 15 medieval churches, four of which are round churches with unique artwork and architecture. The ancient site of Rispebjerg has remains of sun temples from the Neolithic and earthworks from the Iron Age. There are 14 European bison near Akirkaby, attracting 100,000 visitors a year. Because of the dilapidated state of their buildings, all secondary educational facilities in Rona, including adult evening classes, are being transferred to new facilities at Campus Bornholm in 2018. Campus Bornholm is a merger formed in June 2010 consisting of Bornholm's Ever School, Bornholm High School and Buck Bornholm, then occupying separate addresses. Learning institutions not part of this formalized collaboration will also be housed at Minerva of Denrona. The building costs were over 300 million Danish kroner. The AP Muller Foundation contributed a sum of 56 million Danish kroner to the project. Jensen Group, an industrial washing and folding machine company, was founded on the island and has a factory in Rona. It is headquartered in Belgium. Bornholm is connected to the Swedish electricity grid by a submarine 60 kV AC cable, which is among the longest AC cables in Europe. This cable is capable of delivering all the electrical energy consumed on Bornholm. However Bornholm also generates its own electricity at small thermal power plants and especially wind turbines. 
Bornholm is also home to a large internationally funded demonstration project to test the viability of novel energy market mechanisms to regulate energy networks with a high prevalence of renewables. 50% of the EcoGrid project is EU-funded, with the remainder coming mainly from large corporations. Bornholm hosts a Marines-like squadron, of the Guard Hazar Regiment at Omgard's Kaysern. Bornholm has an oceanic climate relatively similar to southern Sweden and mainland Denmark, whose summer highs and winter lows are heavily moderated by its maritime and isolated position. Even though heat is rare, the climate is sunny during summers and rainfall is generally sparse for a climate of this type. The winter 2010-2011 was exceptionally extreme with snow depth reaching at least 146 centimeters, 2 inches short of 5 feet the highest in northern Europe. Military assistance was needed. The DMI estimated the weight of snow to be 100 million tonnes. Bornholm's geography as an island and moderate climate makes Bornholm an ideal location for sailing and other water-based sports. Bornholm has also become an internationally recognized venue for match racing, a sailing sport where two identical yachts are raced in one-on-one events on the water. The Danish Open event was held in Bornholm in September 2010 at the port town of Rona on the western coast of Bornholm. The five-day Danish Open is a key event in the World Match Racing Tour calendar which is one of only three events awarded special event status by the International Sailing Federation. The Tour is the world's leading professional match racing series and features a nine-event calendar which crosses three continents during the series. Points accrued during the Danish Open contribute directly to the World Match Racing Tour Championship with the winner of the season finale at the Monsoon Cup in Malaysia claiming the ultimate match racing title ISAF World Match Racing Champion. There are two small stadiums, Nexu Stadion, in Nexu, where NB Bornholm Association Football Club play, and the slightly larger multi-use stadium Rona Stadion Nor in Rona, which serves the Bornholm national football team, multi-section club most well-known for athletics Ik Viking, and several local football clubs. The DBU Bornholm is the local branch governing football on the island. Christian Zartman Michael Ancher Self-Portrait 1902 Wilhelm Harald as Lohen Green Pia Ranslet Hans Peter Kofod Magnus Court The Island of Bornholm, a chapter in selected prose by Nikolai Mikhailovich Karimzin, 1969 Northwestern University Press. The Battle of Bornholm and the Hidden Folk, Stories of Fairies, Dwarves, Selkies, and Other Secret Beings, by Lisa Lunge Larson, 2004, Houghton Mifflin. The Templar's Secret Island, The Knights, The Priest, and The Treasure, 1992, by Erling Hogginson and Henry Lincoln behind the Da Vinci Code. 2006 documentary by the History Channel Bornholm I. Krieg 1940-1946, Bornholm Museum, 2001, ISBN 978-87-88179-491. Book of Photos from World War II. Vent Jensen, Soviet Remote Control, The Island of Bornholm as a Relay Station in Soviet-Danish Relations, 1945-71. In Mechanisms of Power in the Soviet Union, Macmillan Press, 2000, ISBN 978-0312-23089-0. Lukasen, M., Jutst Till Ortografie über Skanska Sprachet mit Morphologie auch Ordliste. Forscher Revisionen, ISBN 978-91-977-265-28, archived from the original on August 8, 2011, Retrieved January 21, 2011 Outlined Scanning Orthography Including Morphology and Word Index. First Revision. Lukasen, M., Jutst Till Ortografie über Skanska Sprachet med Morphologie auch Ordliste, ISBN 978-91-977-265-11, archived from the original on August 12, 2010. Retrieved July 27, 2010 Outlined Scanning Orthography Including Morphology and Word Index. Thanks for watching.